welcome to the Roblox Steam Show. Our mission to help you to turn your home into a smart home continues. Today, we are going to build an automatic illuminating nightlight together. So what do we need to build an automatic illuminating nightlight? Here, let me show you. First of all, of course, you will need an RGB module to light up. And then, to make it smarter, you also would need a PIR sensor or detector. And we wanted to make it more charming or charismatic, you also need to give it a facial expression. This little guy, we call it the guardian of the night. So the working principle behind our guardian of the night is that we use the a PIR sensor. PIR stands for passive infrared detector, okay? And then this PIR sensor can detect any heat object within the range of 3 meters. And once it's detected, this PIR sensor will send a signal to our RGB light to light it up. And with our LED dot matrix screen, it welcomes you with a smiley face. And when you leave the certain range, which is three meters, then it will go to sleep just like you. Now let's take a look at the code. Okay, so now our robot is connected with the PC. Let's start programming. Here, I already have the entire program ready so it will be easier to explain. Right here, it says connected and now QSCAL is ready. And always, always start with our when program begin block, which you can find in uh, event sector and find forever block because we want this event to happen whenever the motion occurs. So the forever block, you can find it in control. And for PIR sensor, we also need to make a variable, which you can find in this variable sector and set a name as PIR and to read from the port three, because that's where we plugged it in. And for this if and else logic, find it in control because we wanted to set a certain condition for this motion to occur and also to be triggered. And so we already said PIR equals number one. So in this case, our PIR only has two status and the number one represents the status motion detected. And then the number zero means that motion not detected. So when, if the PIR's status is one, meaning that some motion, some heat object in motion is detected, these four steps will be triggered. Right here, we say first play a note. And secondly, show a join. We have a smiley face here as welcoming smiley face. And then set the onboard light to the color yellow. And the RGB LED light then will be triggered to light up. And right here, we already set the color to a bright yellow. And then wait three seconds. After three seconds, the light will go off. And here, this time period, you can set it as long as you want or as short as you want to suit your needs. And if this doesn't happen, meaning if PIR sensor does not detect any object in motion, then this will be triggered. First of all, to show, to go back to the sleeping expression and to set the onboard color to the color red. And all of this is when the status detects either number one or number zero. And if this doesn't happen, then the norm or the regular, the original state of the robot should be no light at all. So here we said extinguish all lights. 
So this is the entire program and this is how we make our little night light light up for you. After building this little night light, do you have any other project for us? You can share with us by leaving a comment in the comment section and if you wanted to join us to make more cool projects and turn home into smart homes please follow us on Facebook, Twitter, LinkedIn, YouTube and Instagram I'll see you next time